know, this school has seen a lot of great events over the past 20 years. And this program is a celebration of all the great people and events that has made Glendale what it is today. We're going to take a look at students off guard, and you teach you some students. And first, we're going to take a look at Mr. Lewis. Then we're going to hear from the birthday committee, and then our first student council president. Currently, in 1980, Glendale has a student body of about 1,150 students. Counting our support staff, uh, teaching staff, we have a staff here of about 100 people. All of us work together to try to make this the kind of place that is a privilege to work in and a growth area not only for the student, but for each one of us who participates during the working day. Over the next few years in the city of Hamilton, the student enrollment will decline. Glendale will participate in that as will every other secondary school in the city. However, since we are in a growth area east of the Red Hill Creek, we will experience less declining enrollment than many of the schools in the city. Our, our uh, enrollment during the next five years may drop off by 100 or a few more students, but generally this school should be able to continue to provide an education for all the citizens in this part of the area. There is no doubt that our school will be used much more in the future for night school, for community meetings, and for other uses that are valuable to the city and to this area especially. We should not um, forget in mentioning about the 20th anniversary and the 20th birthday celebration, the very special way that we plan to celebrate that occasion this year. On May 1 and May 2, we are going to have a host of exciting events that will add up to pride for all of us in what our school can do. As we build upon the presentation of our play, No No Nanette, we will be moving toward the birthday celebrations themselves. They will include involvement by the mayor. They will include involvement by many people in the arts and crafts and academic areas of our city who will be making presentations to staff and students. It will involve participation by all of our students in a, a new kind of learning experience that is not available to them on a daily basis, but which should be one that they will remember long after the 20th birthday has passed away and long after they have been far away from Glendale Secondary School. We realize that over the years in a school, the most lasting things are going to be the relationships that people are able to make with one another. We hope that the academic lessons will be re remembered. We hope that uh, the things that were taught in class, the experiences, will be something that is worthwhile throughout the future. But most of all, we are assured that in the days ahead, the things that students of Glendale Secondary School today and 20 years ago today will remember most are the relationships that they were able to build during the time that they spent in this building and with the people in this building. The relationships with friends who shared some of their joys and sorrows during the school days, the agonies when they had to face lack of success or less success than they had anticipated, the relationships that have been created with teachers are some that will be remembered for, for lifelong times, especially after a few, a few years out of the school. So going to school involves so many things, beginning with people and going through extracurricular activities, 
community involvement, charitable collections, participation of people growing and living and respecting other people. The motto for Glendale has always been and continues to be ad excellentium, toward excellence. We try to hold that motto in front of every member of our staff every day that we are part of this school building. We hope that it will be something that is meaningful to us as we continue our path down life. To try to strive for excellence is an important goal for each one of us. So as we celebrate our, our birthday, every, every student, I think, looks to that past that has got Glendale to the place where it is today, a much respected school in this community. I think that each one of us, too, will look ahead and feel that it is our right and our goal and our duty to make some contribution to the next 20 years of the history of this school. It would be easy to continue to talk about people who have participated in Glendale, to talk about events that have occurred at Glendale, to talk about plans for the days ahead. But perhaps it is best on an occasion like this simply to say, we are looking forward to the 20th birthday to be the happiest birthday to date. We will be looking forward to the celebration of our 25th anniversary five years from now. We believe and will continue to believe that Glendale Secondary School, with the, with the staff and the students and the parents in this community, has a tremendous future as it has had a tremendous past. And so we say to Glendale, happy 20th birthday, many happy returns, and good luck in the days ahead. Ready to go? We are going. Oh! <laughs> 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 Today, you can can tell it. It. It'll be <laughs> Can I introduce Helen? <laughs> My student council. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> She's in charge of the student committee and the president. The co president. One of the co presidents this year. Now we won't. That's it. Cut. Goodbye. All right. I would like to thank Mrs. Morris for all the work she has done this year on the birthday committee. She has done an excellent job, and we really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, I don't know what to say. <laughs> um, I just, I just like to say I'm proud to represent everybody in this year since it's our 20th anniversary. And I would also like to thank Helen, who's been very hard working on our council, and Mrs. Morris for organizing the whole thing. It took much hard work and effort.